Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. So today um, I did want to share with you um, that I am 30 weeks pregnant. I haven't been, you know, documenting um, the pregnancy until this bit because I'm at, you know, the third trimester and I just wanted to let everybody know what's going on um, with me. Um, <clears throat> I'm really excited and I'll show you <laughs> my bum. At 30 weeks, <laughs> I have gained weight as expected, but you know, that's normal. So, hopefully, I'll be able to share more information with you as I get closer to my due date. Um, but now, I also want to like. Um, do my makeup because I am going to be stepping out again and um, I just want to do like a quick makeup look that hopefully I really hope you will enjoy so let's get started. So here I'm putting on the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser by Maybelline and I always wash my hands before I apply anything on my face. I'm also going to apply the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer base. Now I'm going to be putting on my eyeshadow. I'm going to start by putting on the MAC. It's a golden color. I don't have the exact name, but I know it's MAC. It's a, like a gold, gold color. And for the uh, crease, I also bought, it's like a bronzer I'm actually going to be using, um, that I bought at Carol Baker Visage here in, at Scarborough Town Center. So I'm just going to be blending those two out. It's the CoverGirl Lash Blast Mascara. About two to three coats I'm putting on now. And this is a L'Oreal True Match in number W4. Um, it's a yellow undertone. Now this color, when I apply it by itself, I feel like, um, it, you know, it just looks so light on my skin, so, um, I definitely apply like a little bit of a darker like powder just so it looks a little lot more natural. But I really like this color too. So it just looks so, <laughs> so um, uh, yeah I apply that. It's a MAC um, mineralized skin finish powder in dark golden and once I put that on, on top it really makes a huge difference. That's the Makeup Forever Contour Kit. I'm using that to contour my face.
Yeah, and blending it out with the powder brush that I had used. And I'm contouring my nose with the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation Stick, foundation, um, stick in number 355. And I'm going to apply a bit of the Makeup Forever highlight on the bridge of my nose. And this is um, a MAC pressed powder, Warming Heart. I'm using it on my cheekbones as a highlight. A little goes a long way. And I decided to put a little bit um, the Cupid's bow, <laughs> but I wasn't really feeling it that much, so I kind of like blended it out with my foundation brush. You can still see it underneath, but not too much. I was just trying it out, you know. And this is the MAC um, Brave Heart, no, Brave Red lipstick. And I just put on a little bit of lip gloss, the red lip gloss, the lip lift gloss from by Carol Baker, Naked Glow. <laughs> put on a little bit too much, so I was just taking some off. And that's just a brown eye pencil just for my eyebrows. I think the brown is like a lot more flattering than the black I used both last time. So yep, yeah, that's um, the finished look. I hope you like. Later. Need like a red, a bold red lip with um, goldish brownish eyes. Um, light contour. And I think it's something that, you know, anybody could wear, just like be confident, no matter, you know, what kind of makeup you have on. When you look good on the outside, it makes you feel good on the inside. And that's really what matters. So I wanted to share this look with you today. If you have any questions, um, please feel free to comment and subscribe to my channel. And I really hope that you enjoyed this video. And I guess I'll see you next time.